My name is Ashton Tanner from San Diego. I was diagnosed within the last year. I want to say my official diagnosis was end of July, beginning of August of 2022. And my first major event uh, was in June of 22. I, like you said, have Marfan syndrome and I'm a mom of four kids. We live in Ohio and I'm also a genetic counseling graduate student. My name is Michaela Tingley. I'm from Kettering, Ohio, which is just a little bit south of Dayton. My brother and I grew up here in Kettering, Ohio. Neither one of us really left. And I'm so, so, so excited to share his story and his journey with VEDS to, you know, just spread awareness and those warning signs to hopefully stick in people's minds and just to keep his story going. I am Benjamin Weissman. I live in Boot, New Jersey. I am 39 years old. I was born with Marfan syndrome. I'm the third generation in my family with Marfan. My grandfather had it. My mother, who's still alive and doing great up in Montreal, has it. And I'm here with it. I'm Jackie Fish, and um, my son George has beds diagnosed when he was seven, and he's now 24. My name is Peter Donato. I have Lois Eats syndrome. I currently live in Boston, Massachusetts, and I was diagnosed with Lois Eats almost 18 years ago. And I'm Kristen St. John, and I'm going to be talking about my daughter Marcy's story with her journey with VEDS. She's six years old now, um, and it's basically been a lifelong journey for her. These are the voices of the people you will hear from on the next season of Staying Connected, sharing their stories or their family members' stories with VEDS or vascular Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome, Marfan Syndrome, and Lois Dietz Syndrome. Don't miss the next season available on July 1st, wherever you listen to podcasts. This is your host, Katie, and I'll see you soon.